Good morning, good day, and good night wherever you may be. This is Art Thomas. Hello everyone, a lot of us suffering from ataxia are looking for prescriptions to help, which they do, but me having acquired ataxia I noticed that certain supplements have worked even better for me. No one informed me of these supplements besides my personal trainer and the vitamin shop. The supplements that helped me out the most which are the first two in this video. Hands down they have been better than any prescription drug that I have tried. To note I am not endorsing or pushing any of these products. There's a list of supplements that I have tried, but the ones that have worked for me the most are in this video. I will start with MCT oil. I first started to notice a difference when I started taking it and going to the gym at the same time. I was much stronger. My personal trainer might have more to say in regards to this. His link is in the description below. Just like in the name oil that's an understatement. This is pure oil like olive oil, but has no taste. It's all good fat for your brain, but before taking this I would consult your doctor because from the supplement health facts it doesn't seem to be the most nutritious. I definitely would stay away from this if you have diabetes unless your doctor says it's okay. I take it in the morning and mix it with something. The second and the most significant supplement for me was starting to use lion's mane. I know this hasn't helped some people with ataxia, but it definitely helped me immediately. Like some drugs you might have to wait, I didn't have to wait at all. It was like a magical drug. Immediately I noticed my balance and coordination became much better. This was the first time in a while that I noticed something so drastic. Since ataxia is a neurological disorder everything usually happens at a snail's pace, but not with lion's mane. Take as recommended which in this case is two capsules once a day. The third supplement is just your standard vitamin E. The main reason for taking this is because my neurologist informed me that my vitamin E numbers were low which is contributing to my speech being very hard to understand that's why I have a computer-generated voice speaking for me because my words sound garbled. Once I introduced this vitamin into my diet my voice improved. Well, you might ask why don't you take a multivitamin? I do, but multivitamins for me are only there to fill in the gaps, not to be a replacement. Me personally, I have to be extremely diligent on how I take vitamins and supplements. I usually have to take them 30 minutes to an hour apart because of my history. If you are wondering my major issue was having fistula in my guts that prevent me from digesting things normally. I'll put a link in the description below of my background that will cover it more. Here come the B vitamins. Everyone with ataxia or any neurological disorder will know how critical B vitamins are for us. B1, also known as thiamine, is very important in general, but having a neurological disorder it can help with many symptoms with ataxia. It won't cure anything, but it will help you out, and your doctor should have informed you on how critical B1 is. It's good for everything. It's good for so much that it would take hours to explain it all. Along with B1, I take B12. I noticed it helps a lot with energy. It is extremely beneficial to anyone with a neurological disorder such as ataxia because it helps the central nervous system and us with ataxia need all the help we can get. The particular version of B12 I have is fast-releasing. Again, I do my best in spacing out my vitamins because I don't want them to override one another because it is possible, and you won't get the full effect of the vitamin. A multivitamin is just what it says it's a supplement that contains a slew of different vitamins. Like I said for me it's just there to fill in the gaps that I'm not getting from food or other supplements. Because of my past my body doesn't process vitamins normally. Now, here is a supplement that has made a huge difference in my sleep which is magnesium l 3 nate This specific formula. There are many different types of magnesium, but with this formula it helps calm the nervous system. I said it helps sleep but doesn't make you fall asleep. It basically makes you sleep more sound. The dreams are out of control though. It's really crazy. I like to track my sleep using the Apple Watch but there are multiple devices out there that do just as good. Here is a screen grab of my sleep. You will notice that my core sleep is significant. Before taking the magnesium l 3 nate you could flip-flop the REM and core sleep. My REM sleep was high and core sleep was low and the deep sleep was pretty much non-existent. 
I can't stress enough on sleep. Getting good sleep does so many good things for the body. Over the past decade I can tell you I very rarely got good sleep because I was constantly traveling to different time zones all around the world. With that said I wish I knew what I know now about sleep. Try and get good sleep. Please help bring awareness to ataxia, which is extremely rare, by pressing that like button, sharing this video, subscribing to the channel, and click that bell icon so you don't miss any upcoming videos. It's all free and thank you.